Hello and welcome to this overview of highlighted features for Mahada 2204. My name is Christina Höppner and I'm the lead of the Mahada Open Source ePortfolio project. The entire Mahada team at Catalyst is pleased to announce this new version of Mahada released on the 27th of April 2022. We would like to thank everybody who contributed one way or another to this release. Please check out the release notes for more details. A number of organizations contributed to this release, mostly through sponsoring new or changed features. In this release, a number of large new features are combined that involve searching for content on the site and supporting learners with their portfolio activities as well as more administrative functions. Let's take a look at some of these highlights. Elasticsearch 7. Mahara supports Elasticsearch 7 for full text searching and learning analytics reports. Enhancements were made to displaying the status of this plugin as well as how items can be re-queued if the search index needs to be rebuilt. It is still possible to use Elasticsearch 5 or 6 in Mahara 2204 if you cannot yet upgrade to Elasticsearch 7. Similarity checking with our original in Moodle. Portfolios submitted to Moodle or Totara via the Mahara Assignment Submission Plugin, Web Services Edition, can be sent to the similarity checker our original, formerly Urkund. This requires an updated version of the our original Moodle plugin that hasn't been published yet by the Catalyst IT Europe team. When a portfolio is submitted, and the Moodle activity requires that submissions go through our original, Mahara sends an HTML export that only contains pages and documents that can be processed by our original. Once the similarity checks have been performed, the result is displayed in the usual manner for the plugin in Moodle. Institution Support Administrator the new role of Institution Support Administrator can be assigned to members of an institution who should be able to have staff permissions, but also be able to masquerade as another member of the institution. They can change account settings for institution members and staff, but cannot log in as institution administrators or change institution settings. This could be a role assigned to help desk staff to assist learners with their questions. Move institution members more easily via SAML. Let's assume you have a Mahara site that lots of organizations use who all share one single sign-on provider. In the past, accounts needed to be moved manually from one institution to the next, making this quite difficult as it required either an action by a learner or by one or more administrators. Thanks to this new functionality, accounts can be added to and removed from institutions automatically based on the information that the IDP provides. If an account has affiliations that are registered with Mahara, Accounts are created, and if that person switches to another institution, their account is moved automatically as well. Upload files via Web Services A new Web Services connection is available that allows organizations to upload files from a third-party platform into Learner's Files area in Mahara. This can be handy if you'd like to keep an electronic record of a certificate or diploma in the portfolio and want to push that out to learners automatically upon their consent. Portfolio completion on the group level. Portfolio completion for collections is available on the group level if your institution allows the use of the portfolio completion functionality. Check your institution settings to make sure. When you set up a group for this institution, or even if you create a collection in an existing group, you have the portfolio completion functionality available. While you cannot sign off a group page, you can use the group portfolio as a template to copy into group members' accounts. Sign up block and templates. When you use the portfolio completion functionality in a template collection, learners copying the collection should most likely not remove the block or change its configuration. Once a copy of the portfolio is made, 
provided it was designated as a template or single pages within the collection were configured as templates, the sign-off block cannot be removed from the page or its settings changed. It can still be moved on the page though if needed. Download Smart Evidence Frameworks Smart Evidence Frameworks can either be imported into Mahara using a JSON file or you can create them directly in the site administration. It is now possible for you to share a framework you created online with other organizations by downloading it as matrix file, which others can then import into their own Mahara instance. Install and update languages. Mahara has been translated in many languages thanks to our fantastic translator community. You can now install additional languages on your Mahara site in the site administration. Select the language you want to add and the translation will be pulled. You can also update already installed translations via this page. These were the highlights for Mahara 2204. Besides these, there are other new features and also improvements to existing functionality. For more details, read the release notes for Mahara 2204. The Mahara manual is available for Mahara 2204, where new features and changes are documented. You can download Mahara from mahara.org slash download and install it on your own infrastructure or ask your support company to upgrade your site. Join the Mahara community at mahara.org to discuss these and other features of Mahara, how you use them at your organization, and what you may like to contribute to evolve portfolio practice using Mahara.